guys! Good day! Once again, we are now back for quarter three. I hope that you were able to enjoy your one-week vacation while your teaching teachers are having online webinars in preparation for quarter three. Looking after into different issues and concern in relation to the new normal situation in order to cater the needs, especially in the delivery of the lesson and in the assessment. So in this regard, I am preparing a video lesson to let you understand better of the lesson. The lesson that I will be giving to you is a continuation of the last topic in quarter two, which is all about parallel lines cut by transversal. But this time, it is more complicated than the last one, since it involves solving problems involving parallel lines cut by a transversal. So to start with the lesson, try to watch the video till the end because at the end part of the video are the exercises for you to answer as your output for week one, quarter three. But before we will have to start the lesson, here are the objectives of this lesson. First is to identify the relationship of each angle in the given figure. The second one is find the measures of the given angle. And the last one, of course, observe patience and accuracy in finding the measure of the different angles in the given figure. Okay, here you go. Keep watching and enjoy learning. In solving problems involving parallel lines cut by a transversal, the problem here is to find the measures of angles 1, 2, 3, and 4 given that line M is parallel to line N. So we have these two lines cut by a tr this transversal. And now whenever there are lines cut by a transversal, you know that there are angles that are congruent. Now we will be using this problem, angles 1 and angles 3. Use same side interior angles. are supplementary. You same side interior angles are supplementary. So, same side interior angles would be angles 1, uh, angles 2, and angles 3. So, the mixture of angles 2 plus angle 3 is equal to 180. And the given in angle 2 is 9x plus 9. So let's put it in there. And angle 3 given us 7x minus 5. And those two angles added together gives you 180 degrees. Now combining um, 9x and 7x that is 16x then combine again 9 minus 5 that will give you 4 equals 180 degrees then subtracting 4 negative 4 in both sides that will give you 16x equals 176 and dividing both sides again by 16 that is x is equal to 11 so measure of angle 2 is equal to 9x plus 9 right So you have to substitute the value of x, which is 11, so that is 9 times 11 plus 9, and that will give you 99 plus 9. Therefore, measure of angle 2 is 108. So that is now the value or the measure of angle 
2, which is also congruent to angle 1 because angles 1 and 2 are vertical angles. So therefore, angles 1 and angles 2 are congruent angles. So if measure of angle 2 is 108, therefore, measure of angle 1 is also 108. Okay, the relationship of angles 1 and 2 are vertical angles. Angles 1 and 4 are also alternate exterior angles. So alternate exterior angles are also congruent. So therefore, measure of angle 4 and angle 1 and measure of angle 2 is equal to 108. And since... Measure of angle 2 and angle 3 are supplementary, so therefore, we have 180, which is the measure of supplementary angles, minus the measure of angle 2, which is 108, therefore giving you 72 uh, degrees. And that is the measure of angle 3. Okay, let us try to substitute measure of angle 3, which is 7x minus 5, so 7 times the value of x, which is 11 minus 5, that is 77 minus 5. Therefore, measure of angle 3 is equal to 72, which is equal or congruent to the other side uh, being solved. So the six items of problems that I am giving you are the problems that you have to answer for days one, two, and three for week one. So meaning that your outputs will serve as your output for week one, days one, two, and three. So in your um, learning activity sheets or last, I am giving you only some of the figures but the entire solution or the entire problem can be answered using watch uh, by watching the video that I am giving you also the link in your activity sheets. That's all for uh, week one, days one, two, three. God bless you all.